one of my favorite things because it just goes with your character, your personality, who you are. It's just, you're just like a real life, like I'm here in the moment. I don't really care who, who we're seeing it. But isn't that how you live your best yeah, life? Yeah, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. But also, there are all of these women who would be like, I mean, in real life, your day to day, yes, they're inspired. They know you, they're inspired. They come in, they support your businesses, they share your business because of you. Her business. You know, you never know. And my thing, but that's probably the best thing is you don't sit up and think about it. That's right. That. And so if it just help continue to build and grow and not worry about like who's doing what, like and what. Yeah, I love it. But I do get inspired by what I see when I get online. So I, 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 and that's what people will, that is exactly the same thing. That's, to, in my mind, like that's the stage that you're at. You're in the, so many people, what, the thing that I see all the time is they want to jump right into the social proof. Like, see, look what I did. Mm -hmm. Remember I was telling you about the person, like they, they'll go through the course and then they come out of the course and they know all the stuff that they've learned, yeah. but they haven't actually applied it mm -hmm. and done it. They're teaching something they heard somebody else say. Yeah. They're, they're literally repeating it. Whereas you, you, you like dug in. That's where I really want to start too, like, how did you know, Vivian? Because this is where we, this is where we met. Okay, well, let's start there. Let's it's start there. I've heard right you tell this story before, but it's not really, <laughs> what you said was kind of true. Like, I'm just here, we're gonna like live life and do it. That was really what happened. Like, I had no intentions on living in Charlotte. I had every intention on moving anywhere in the world, <laughs> outside of the United States. So I didn't want to be here. here. You said that sounds like that's that. me now, yeah. Yeah, I didn't want to live in the United States. I planned on traveling everywhere. I was applying for jobs in Korea, in South Africa, anywhere, India. I don't know how I, and looking back, I mean, I guess some of the questions I would get on like the applications, it kind of mm -hmm. let me know like, okay, I'm not gonna get this job. <laughs> I don't know you do it. But I just was like, so this is not gonna actually happen, I think. You know, like I'm hoping <laughs> something will fall through, but at any point, the money Wait, that I had saved. What jobs were you applying to in South Africa? Any, like anything, I can't even remember. It was just like, I got online. I don't even remember what I looked at. At one point I was like, okay, maybe like Teach for America. Cause you know, they were like, okay, I a lot of people, well afterwards, I saw a lot of people were like really moving places with teaching English in other countries. Okay, yeah. But I can't remember what I actually Googled. <laughs> like, I don't even know what platform, but it was just like, wherever it was like hiring. And so, girl, I was applying places. I didn't get hired nowhere. And then I got pregnant.